Hey guys, I'm Ryan. I'm Adam. And this is Two Neighbors. So Adam, what are we watching today? All right, Ryan, we got a little special John Panette. We haven't done him in a while. I love John Panette. John too. Panette, yeah. Uh, may he rest in peace. Yeah. This one is a request, and it is requested by Goodest Cat. Thank you very <laughs> much, Goodest Cat. I think we've done Goodest Cat uh, request before. All right. So this might be the second. Thank you, Goodest Cat. Thank you, Goodest Cat. Uh, John Panette, still hungry in 2011. Okay. Okay. So, going back, it's hard to imagine 2011 is 10 years ago. 10 years ago. ago. Isn't that crazy? That is nuts. It doesn't sound like it's 10 no. years ago. No, I remember when like, I felt like if, if I'm driving. Millennium. If I'm driving a 2011 car, it doesn't sound like it's a 10-year-old car, does right? it? Right? That's yeah. nuts. Yeah, my first car was in 1991. Really? Yeah. My first car was in 1995. Okay. That's, Ford that's, Aero, that's 1995 Ford Aerostar. Oh, wow. You were pimping. I, uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> 1994 or 1997. I can't really recall. I think it was 95. Okay. Anyways, but yeah, it was a Ford Aerostar. It was, you know, they called it my shaggy wagon. It was an extended cab. Right. <laughs> Whatever, bud. Right. Whatever. Anyways, we'll get back to the show now. Uh, guys, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe to the channel. Two Neighbors takes two seconds of your time. Won't take you long at all. Please turn on that little bell for notifications because we post content all the time. So we don't want you to miss it. And please also check out okanswag.com. Punch in Two Neighbors in the coupon code at checkout. And you'll re receive some awesome Canadian swag for 20% off, plus free shipping and pay no tax. And uh, free shipping, right? So uh, and worldwide, too. I don't know if it's free shipping. No, it's not free shipping worldwide. It's free shipping in North America. Yeah, if you live somewhere outside of North America, you it's like pony 20, up some It's cash, like 20 bucks, I think, to send anywhere else in the world. But yeah, let's do it. Jump it in. Last summer, I went to a health and fitness place. Yes, and I had a stress test in blood work. And I go to this doctor there, wonderful lady, but my stress test in my blood work are good and she's shocked <laughs> I mean at least be a little happy don't look like horrified that I, I don't have anything bad this is how she told me she <laughs> I guess she bet the over I don't know <laughs> Is this you? <laughs> These are good. Your blood pressure is 112 over 70. A... We'll have that checked. It must be Celsius. Is there Celsius on there? No, there is not. <laughs> Can we have a little joy and gratitude? I... Being healthy. As he wipes his brow the doctor at this standing. healthy fit, fitness place told me one thing. She looked at me very seriously, and you know I, I'm, I'm not getting any younger, and I and I, I was nervous for a minute. And she said, "Did you know that you're allergic to wheat?" <laughs> and I looked at her and said. But I'm a wheat farmer! <laughs> I'm allergic to wheat and I thought, oh well, I can't harvest wheat anymore. <laughs> I'm hanging up my sickle. Because don't friends call you in the fall and go, we're harvesting this weekend, you never miss. I can't. I'm allergic. I'm allergic. <laughs> Then I thought, wait a second, you make flour out of wheat. Perhaps I should inquire further. <laughs> I said, what does this whole wheat thing mean to me, pray tell? <laughs> she said, well, do you eat a lot of gluten? <laughs> I don't know what gluten is. <laughs> oh, but I would say yes. <laughs> I'm... I'm fairly certain I'm mostly gluten. <laughs> and she said, well, you should avoid anything with gluten in it. <laughs> I said, okay, thank you, and started to leave the room, and I said, what has gluten in it? <laughs> you know what has gluten Every, in it? Everything. Every day! Yeah. <laughs> Every reason to wake up in the morning! 
<laughs> I'm looking at this thing of things to avoid, and I said, check again, maybe it's just cancer. How <laughs> oh, am I going to live? <laughs> Ah, uh, so when did he pass away? Well, in the last 10 years, but I, I don't know. It, it seems like it's been a while. Now, um, he's a very, very funny, or he was a very, very funny comedian. Um, I don't know if you guys watch any other John Panett specials, but uh, very, very funny stuff. You got he died it. three years later, uh, uh, April 5th, 2014. Okay, well, um, I don't know. Clearly you didn't cut out Do you really want to be a good comedian? It seems like all the good comedians kind of die young-ish. Yeah. I, I say young-ish because... Um, he was like, what, in his 40s? Well, no, I, yeah. I, I mean, I had to factor 50. in... 50. Um, he, he turned 50. Yeah, well... Uh, Pulmonary embolism. The, yeah. That's how he died. Sad. He, he's, a, he's a funny guy. He was a funny guy. Yeah, he was a funny guy. Yeah, but blockage of artery and lungs. Anyways, guys, um, we want to watch some more John Panett. So, uh, if you guys have any more videos of John Panett and or just anything in general you think we might want to watch, put it down below with hashtag my request along with the link to the video, and we'll check it out. But uh, John Panett was definitely a special comedian. Mitch Hedberg was the other guy I was thinking about. Mitch Hedberg, another comedian. Yeah. Brilliant. Died too young. It makes me think um, that I need to work on myself. We all, we all got to keep ourselves in shape. I'm at 35. So, you know, I'm only 15 years away from that. Stop watching YouTube unless you're yeah. watching all of our <laughs> stuff, in which case carry on. But stop watching YouTube. Go for a walk. Do whatever. Go Enjoy play in the, the great outdoors. In which, it, unless you're watching this in the middle of Canada, in the middle of winter, in which case stay indoors. It'll be better for your health. Absolutely. promise you that. <laughs> uh, yeah, guys, before we go, please don't forget to check out okanswag.com. Punch in two neighbors in the coupon code at checkout and you'll get 20% off plus free shipping and pay no tax on some sweet Canadian swag. Yeah, and if you're wearing one of those sweet Canadian swag hoodies in the winter, it could save your life. So if you're They're living very, in Canada, very cozy. keep very you warm. Cozy. We'll they, be, are, they are very We'll be cozy. back in those very soon, eh, Ryan? Unfortunately, I'm just enjoying <laughs> t-shirt weather for now. Well, we got plenty of t-shirts too. Yeah. <laughs> That's it for our show today, guys. Uh, oh, right. What else should they do? Like, share, and subscribe, guys. If you haven't done so, hit that subscribe button down below when you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you turn on the bell for notifications. We post new content almost every single day, and we don't want you to miss it. Auctioneer Ryan over here. So <laughs> That's it for our show today, guys. Thanks for joining us, and we will see you next time. Later, guys. Later.